Will you pray with me? Creator God, loving spirit, we're here today for a very specific reason, to lift up the names of those who have died or suffered illness or injury on the job in North Carolina. We've gathered at this particular spot because on March 23rd, 2015, Jose Hernandez, Jose Luis Lopez Ramirez, Anderson Almeida lost their lives here. Elmer Guevara was injured. Gracious God, we turn to you, remembering what these men contributed to our world and lifting up their families, friends, and co-workers whose lives have been forever changed by this tragedy. Today is Workers' Memorial Day. We've called this press conference a memorial observance to remember the names of those who died on the job or because of their job. We're advocates, labor leaders, faith community, and workers. We're here together to call on the North Carolina Department of Labor to do more, and really to, just to do their job to protect all workers in North Carolina from death and injury at their workplaces. This is simply their job. As recently reported by the News and Observer, dozens of North Carolina workers die each year with little or no notice from state officials. No questions are asked, no reforms demanded, and no fines are levied. And in 2013, 79% of deaths went unreported by our Commissioner Sherry Berry. She hasn't even sought advice from the OSHA Advisory Council for five years and that's part of her job to do. We say that when workers die on the job, their deaths should count for something, especially to our labor commissioner. Every worker's death needs to be counted and accurately reported. Sherry Berry, we are talking to you. You need to be with us to honor and mourn the dead and to fight for the living. 